Arakan's ships are guarding the wormhole, so access is limited. A small craft like a shuttle or fighter might be able to slip through the blockade, so leave your starship here at Bajor. Commander Samuel Winters is here, and he's one of the best shuttle pilots I know. I recommend you bring him along. The war is over, but Loris and Karu Khan won't believe it unless they hear it from someone they trust.
Jim'Hadar ship is on an intercept course, sir. Shields and weapons are at full, Captain. Ready to engage. Setting the course for the wormhole now. We'll be halfway to the Gamma Quadrant before the Jim Hadar know what happened. Wow, that's some view. This is my first trip into the wormhole. Thanks for letting me tag along. Captain Curlin says there's a traitor in the Idrit system who knows how to contact the Dominion. She's probably our best chance for finding them quickly. But Curlin says Farek's help won't come cheap. We need to be ready to negotiate with her. When we're out of the wormhole, we should start searching for Farek's vessel. Picking up a ship on long-range sensors, Captain. The configuration matches Farik's ship, sir, but I'm detecting damage to several systems. There's no response to a hail, sir, but her communications array might be damaged. 
Setting a course to the ship's coordinates now. Ship is under attack. I can hear profit in the wind, and the wind is blowing. If you want it, I've got it. That's me, the best trader with the biggest deals in the sector. I have Utterberry futures, cultural artifacts from a hundred different worlds, alpha current nectar, disruptor rifles, and the best salvage this side of the galactic barrier. Or maybe you're interested in something else. Need a guide to the Gamma Quadrant? How about someone who can take you to the hidden markets? Or get you into the Dosi system unnoticed? If you have the Latinum, I have what you need. Time is money. Oh, <laughs> that? <laughs> Nothing really. Nothing you need to be concerned about. You just can't make some customers happy. Time is my profit. While it's easier for women to run their own businesses now on Ferenginar, there's still a lot of prejudice. And I'm not about to stay home naked chewing tube grubs. I was a dealer of assorted and sundry merchandise in the Bolian sector till there was a slight problem with my business partners. Through absolutely no fault of my own, my business license from the FCA was temporarily Until I can get the paperwork straightened out, I decided to set up shop out here. It's great out here. There's hardly any competition and deals to be made everywhere. The body aren't any trouble once you learn the rules of that crazy game. The dosi are too scared of the Karema to be a real challenge, and everyone else is either running from the Dominion or part of it. Time is money. Well, now, that's an uh, interesting question. I know where to find the Dominion, of course. I can even get you in touch with a Borda who has a direct line to the founders. He's a close personal friend as well as a valued client. In fact, I always keep a case of Covenant Crunch on board just for him. However, the location of one of my best customers is not information I share for free. And no offense, friend, but you don't look like you can afford what I would charge. Time is money. I'll give it to you straight. 
intel about the Dominion is hard to acquire, and therefore extremely valuable. You don't have a cargo hold big enough for all the latinum I'd want to but I'm willing to consider an alternative method of payment. You see that planetoid over there? I have a limited amount of time to collect everything valuable from it that I can. And as you can see, my ship could use some repairs. While my crew and I work on fixing this baby up, I could use some help with the salvage. So, here's the deal. You get me something I can turn a profit with, and I'll tell you where you can find the Dominion.
I've got that's great. Nice doing business with you. I'll just verify the transport and then I'll contact my friend, the very important reporter. I'm sure that he'll be able to help you with whatever you need. Quick! Cut the car! Jump to warp! What do you mean we don't have warp drive yet? Get it going! Now! Wait, can they still hear me? You know the funny thing about resonance pulses? They drive the swarmers crazy. Thank you.
Forex ship has life support and engines, sir, but that's about it. Shields are failing, but she only has limited weapons. The lead Jim Hood, our vessel is hailing us, sir. Putting it on screen now. Ah, uh, so the representatives of the Alpha Quadrant finally we have been their way to seek a expected from the Dominion. According to our information, you're having a slight occupation problem on Deep Space Nine. I might be able to assist you with that problem if you have come here in friendship. And as we all know, friends help one another. You can start by destroying this nuisance and her ship. She has intruded into the Gamma Quadrant without permission and is conducting unauthorized salvage operations in our space. The penalty for this is clear. By all rights, we should execute you as well. But I am willing to overlook your involvement this time. So, as the Ferengi would say, do we have a deal? We are still friends, right? I'm in a bit of a spot here. Got any help for your old pal, Farrick? Hey, friend, look! I found the Dominion for ya. You, you have to help me, they're crazy. Okay, okay, I'll go. I'll go back to the Alpha Quadrant, I'll refund their Latinum. I'll even give them what's left in my cargo holds, just don't let them kill me. And that resonance pulse, <laughs> funny, huh? I knew those little suckers couldn't really hurt me. If you let me go, I know Iran won't hunt me down again. He's got too many other problems to worry about a small timer like me. Just please, let me go. You come seeking my aid and then refuse a simple request? This is not an auspicious start. <sighs> Nevertheless, you have something I want, and I have something you need. The only logical conclusion is cooperation. I will return to the Alpha Quadrant with you and render whatever assistance I can. Hmm, there is a price though. For more than 30 years, Starfleet has held one of the founders as a prisoner of war. Imagine the hubris it takes to contain a god. The arrogance. When the Founder is returned to me, you will have the Dominion's complete cooperation and my guarantee that Karukan and his fleet will not trouble Deep Space Nine again. 